Are peso peso machines a viable business in the Philippines? The first thing I want to say is I've had people say, oh, but every household's got a computer. Every household's probably got about six kids as well. One computer, six kids, doesn't work, whatever, whatever world you're living in. Um, what you have to look at is people want a bit of space themselves. So what you have is somebody will go along to an internet calf. That's why there's still so many internet calves. There's still a need for this and the advantage you've got with pace or pace machines you don't have to sit by them and um, pace or pace or by the mean uh, why the by the way means is coin operated so you drop a coin in 10 pesos at a time and the timer goes up and then it'll time out the monitor and leave the pc running myself i found them extremely viable um, i was running five at one five at a time um, they were just left outside the front of the house no air conditioning costs, no building costs, and they were out there 24-7. Nobody, nobody stole them, nobody took them away, although they were chained to this side of the house. <laughs> um, yes, it's a viable business, and it's one I would recommend. Although you've got a initial outlay, because you're looking at probably about three to 5,000 pesos for the boxes, which is why you've seen that I built my own. Um, the computer outlays, you need to look at what you want. If you want the noisy gamer kids, then fair enough, you invest in a gaming machine. If it's mainly for people that are looking for the boyfriend online, etc., then you just need a basic PC, and you can find those pretty dirt cheap, to be honest. Um, I think our cheapest ones were about 7,000 pesos, or even less than that, including the monitor. So it all depends what sort of people are going to be using it, but they are a viable business and it's one of those things you can just leave outside the front door and um, if you're in a compound etc and it will make you money uh, it worked for me for years we, we eventually sold it purely because I wasn't there to maintain them because um, you need to obviously if the computer breaks there's only one person that fixes these things so I'm not there there's nobody to fix it right thanks for watching